Finally tonight, medical care these days is often criticized for relying too much on machines and not enough on human connection. While that may be true, one hospital in Canada has found a machine with a magic touch for children trying to recover. Here's NBC's Jacob Rascone. They call him Super Cooper. A five-year-old with boundless energy. Hospitalized two weeks ago after a lawnmower accident took his foot. Did you get to choose the colors? Mm -hmm. It was really difficult for me. I was involved with the accident. And it was um, every father's worst nightmare. But the Alberta Children's Hospital had a unique treatment for Cooper. Meet Medi. I'm doing my best to avoid obstacles. Two feet tall, 11 pounds, and plenty of heart. Put something in my hand, please. He asks if Medi's coming every yeah. morning. He thinks so. it's so cool. There's nothing like seeing kids walk into a procedural room and seeing Medi. Their faces light up. And they follow what Medi says and does. They're transfixed. It's almost hypnotic. Dr. Tanya Barron of the University of Calgary created Medi after her research showed robots can ease pain and stress for Thank children you. in ways humans can't. They seem to enjoy the experience more. And the nurses were more relaxed. So it kind of helped everyone get through that situation a bit better. Ten-year-old Aiden Sosa's routine injections for severe asthma are now almost fun. He does something like a Tai Chi or something to distract me. Does wow. it work? Yeah, it does. <laughs> What's interesting about Medi is it he's always... My name is Medi. Yes, what? What? I'm a robot. Oh, okay. I'm okay with you so you feel better. I feel much better. Thanks, Medi. <laughs> We know from some studies that kids are actually more likely to follow instructions from a robot than they are even from adults. Can we go to the family room with us? Cooper talks to him like he's a person. Hey, he actually thinks, you're my best friend, look, let's like hang out. So he's like, come on, we'll, let's go, let's go for a walk. We're lucky that he's been able to experience, for sure. With Medi in his life, Cooper is actually looking forward to what's next. Anxious to get his robot foot. Yeah, he's excited for that. Dr. Barron's creations are in six hospitals throughout Canada and one in the U.S. Proving the future of healing now partly in the hands of robots. Jacob Rascone, NBC News, Alberta, Canada.